Hello again. Every franchisor will tell you how great their system is. In an earlier lesson, we spoke about the five essentials for business success. So let's take a look at how that ties in to the franchise system. The first thing a franchise will do is allow you to use their trademark business name. This will give you quicker name recognition and acceptance in your community. They'll also provide you advertising to promote your product or service, which not only includes assisting you in your day-to-day -day operations, but many times includes guidance on site location, lease negotiations, preferred suppliers, ongoing training, and support. But most importantly, they'll teach you how to use their system. So what is a system and how can it benefit you? Every franchise has one, and quite frankly, some are better than others. But how can you tell the difference? So what we thought we'd do is show you our system so that if and when you look at another franchise, you'll have something to compare to. The first thing a system must do is to solve a problem and or fulfill a need. So what you must ask yourself is, is there a market for this product? Is it something that is enduring or is it a fad or something that may soon become obsolete? How is this system different from the competition? And will it give me a competitive advantage, which is called differentiation? In our case, framed art is a multi-billion dollar industry. It is something that you will find in every home and office, more than likely in every room. Art is something that has withstood the test of time. Even in our computer age, if you go into a room where there's no art on the walls, it seems cold and stark. And the art we have reflects an image of who we are, where we've been, and where we're going. and speaks volumes about our lifestyle and values. After all, a picture is worth a thousand words, and we do live in an image-conscious society. So then, what sets us apart from the competition? Well, you'll notice when you first step into our model gallery that it is spacious and that there is a great selection of art to choose from, whereas most frame shops are small, poorly merchandised, and have a limited selection of framing products to choose from. We have a patented racking system that allows us to display thousands of frame molding samples where most shops have only a few hundred. Also, you'll notice that our frame racking display is out in the open, not behind a counter, so that it is easy for people to take frame samples off the wall and try different things until they get it just the way they like it. Also, in most shops on the back of their molding samples, the price is marked in dollars per foot, whereas we use a numbering system that goes from 1 to 15. The higher the number, the more expensive the molding. And when we put it into our point of sale order management device, it will figure out the price and then you can either go up or down from there. If you see that a frame molding you choose is a 6, that is going to be a lot easier for you to deal with than if I said it was $20 a foot. It's the same reason they give you chips in Las Vegas. Okay, I mentioned our proprietary order management system earlier. Computers are essential in any modern industry today, but the more you ask them to do, the more complex and difficult they become to use. So we broke our system down into three parts. The handheld point of sale device, whose sole purpose is to make it easy for both you and the customer to take the order and make the sale. The store computer to take care of accounting and record keeping. And finally, the main server, whose purpose is to create and track the work orders and tie local networks together. I'll explain that in greater detail a little later. Let's take a look at the point of sale device first. The first thing that you'll notice is that it is small and it is portable, which makes it friendly and easy to share information with the customer. It has a large touch tone screen to make it easy for both you and the customer to view and make changes. It has a QWERTY keyboard to enter information, a barcode scanner to scan data and avoid typo errors. The program is menu driven, so it is easy to learn, and depending on how you answer the questions, it will intuitively branch off in different directions, taking your customer seamlessly through the process quickly and making it easy for them to make a buying decision. If there are multiple orders, and we've had as many as 150 orders in here at one time, it will keep a cumulative total at the bottom so your customer can see where they are at and at any point in time make changes to any of the orders quickly and easily. Once the order is complete, you ask the customer for their phone number and enter it into the handheld device 
And then you place the device and its cradle by the store computer and push a button and the order is transferred over the store computer, which prints out a hard copy of the work order, creates an invoice, and after you have collected the money, it prints out a customer receipt. If the customer has purchased from you before, their contact information is already on file and will be auto-filled on the work order. If it is a first-time purchase, you simply ask them to fill in their information at the top of the work order. Once a customer has left at your convenience, you can pull up the work order in the store computer, complete their personal contact information, and then double-check the order to make sure everything is correct. After that's done, you simply push a button, and the order will be transferred over the Internet to our central server at the Hub, which is connected to all of the local satellite stores and is where all the orders are fabricated and then delivered back to the respective stores. By funneling all the orders to a central hub, it gives us buying power and economies of scale that others cannot match. We did a comparison where we took the same picture, we framed it, then we went to fast frame and asked them to frame it as close to ours as possible, then we snipped out a 50% off coupon from Michael's and took it there and asked them to frame it for us. All three pictures are on display at our model gallery, and whenever we show this to people, the results speak for themselves, and we usually get a wow. Other important facets of the Hub and Spoke business model are that the franchisee doesn't have to buy or allocate space for expensive equipment and or materials, which means that they can afford to be in a more upscale location and devote more of their space for selling and need fewer employees since most of the work is already done for them. So, have you figured out the problem which our system solves? We've taken something that is considered time-consuming, arduous, and expensive, and made it fun and easy for people to do. Once people discover that they can create a personal masterpiece at a reasonable price, they love it. It's like Build-A-Bear Workshop for grown-ups, and they want to repeat the experience again and again. Finally, whatever you choose, you should think about quality of life. Is this something that you will enjoy and find fulfilling? In our business, you're in a stress-free environment where you'll be surrounded by beautiful artworks and soft music. Since every job is different, the work will never be mundane. You'll be able to take pride that you are creating beautiful artifacts that will be treasured for many years and hung in a prominent place in your patron's home or office where they will become a conversation piece that creates word of mouth publicity. And most importantly, you'll be dealing with a cultured clientele Will appreciate the finer things of life and have the discretionary income to afford them. Well, that's our system. I think that you can see that there is a lot more to a system than first meet CI. Whatever franchise you might choose for yourself, hopefully this will give you some insight as to what to look for and what to avoid. In closing, let me say that I truly hope that this course helps you to find a franchise opportunity that is rewarding and fulfilling as my business has been for me, where for the last 18 years, it's still fun to come to work every day.